What's going on guys? Mark Berry here again. Uh, a couple weeks late on this, but you know, better late than never, I guess. So, uh, got these in. This I had this on pre-order. I didn't know if I was wanting to order any of them or not. Um, but this is Penny, The Walking Dead Series 2. Before anybody says anything, this is Series 2 of the toys of the comic series, okay? They already came out with the television show. So the first series of the show was like Daryl and Rick and all that stuff. And then Series 2 had Shane and the Well Zombie and so on. These are Series 2 of the comic series. So uh, they're a little bit different and everything. Um, so the first series of these came out like as the show was coming on or whatever. Um... They didn't really do good. They weren't selling very good um, until series one of the show kicked off. When they released those, that's when the toys started to boom. And these, the Walking Dead toys are like the only thing that's booming right now. So, uh, but anyway, I pre-ordered this uh, two months ago, a while ago. I just wanted to check them out before I ordered any, and it took forever. So, um, but yeah. I want to unbox this real quick. Like I said, this is Penny. Look how many things she comes with. Like all these little uh, intestines and a bucket and everything. Let me get my box cutter knife here. Usually when I review toys, you know, we, we throw them right up on the store. Um, not going to be the case with this one. This is for my uh, own personal collection. I'm keeping this flap open here so if I want I can put her back in there and it'd still be connected. Mm -hmm. There we go. Look at that. That looks neat. Neat. Freaking neat. Um, so you can put the heads in there and everything as you can tell. Uh, it's pretty cool. And then you got uh, Elsa Singia. A little bucket and it actually has a handle on it too how about that um so yeah she comes with you know she's coming with this and the intestines which is pretty gross but they're really detailed um you got some feet you can put the feet in this little can the intestines in the can um yeah this is pretty gross <laughs> um, and then that's why the uh, the packaging says 13 plus so you need to be 13 or over to, uh, she uh, she has the most accessories too uh, the governor like you, you can see the backs there the governor and their uh, film gear riot gear Glenn and then the other zombie. If you look on the back you can get a uh, Mike which is Michonne's pet zombie but in Penny's you get the uh, interchangeable head here which can make it into uh, what was it? Pet Zombie Terry so you're gonna have so you can change it into any zombie you want and I'm pretty sure like I don't know if you can no. So I thought you could put hands and stuff on there but it's pretty neat you can tell right here so you can put the head onto this zombie walker if you want. Which that's pretty cool. So it kinda it's kinda like, hey you gotta get this one to get that one type thing. Which it's a good marketing scheme. But it's pretty neat nonetheless. Penny might be my favorite one. because uh, she comes with so many neat things. And her heart. Yeah, I mean it is the detail. The detail on all this stuff is just really, really I mean, McFarlane's just doing a great job with it. Um, so, if you love Walking Dead as much as I do, and you like the comic book series, uh, pick these up. I'm pretty sure you can get them on eBay for like 10 bucks with shipping. So, um, no more than 15 right now. Or just go to your local comic shop. I know they got them. Uh, I think they're like 15 bucks too. So, definitely do that. Um, I might have some coming soon. Uh, I'm not sure right now. Um... But yeah, check them out, Re the review, 
I'd say go buy them if you like The Walking Dead and you like action figures. Um, but yeah. Check it out. Spread the word. Let me know what you think.